All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, welcome back to the Outer Worlds. Let's finally investigate human, I, like, I forget exactly what it's called. I think it's called, it's something like human resources, though. Wait, was this the door we came in? Yep. I think in here's broken or shot to hell. Haven't found any more of, uh, what's his name, Lucky Montoya's, uh, stuff at all. He just dropped off the face of the earth. Show your boss that you are prime because you think you Oh, oh my law. What is that smell? Sewage? Whatever it is, we're up to our ankles in it. Sewage. Yep, it's a giant sewage pipe. on people. I'm surprised he's still alive. to disturb them, but I have to be here. Clearly don't know how we work, Captain. We made it through, Kem, okay? We can make it through this. Yeah, we can. Right? Yeah, you're right. We're good. We've done far worse. quarters and there is the most blood here <coughs> okay maybe not there is a corpse a whole bunch of supplies We're supposed to be volunteers. Why do they got him bunking like prisoners? Well, at least they kept him close to the drugs. Well, I think the word volunteer was sort of a uh, euphemism. Sort of like how uh, Bill O'Reilly once called slaves undocumented immigrants. Or like unpaid laborers or some such. And they all know I'm here. 
all of China knows I'm here. Son of a bitch! Take a look around everywhere else. Since we cleared the room. Checking this. Wait. Observation room. Alright, well, let's try here. Oh, this was optional. Wow. We could spy on just about everyone from here. Mr. Thompson would have been over the moon. Well, I guess that's why they call it an observation room. Okay, so this is a good way to get there without probably having to go through a bunch of hassle. Alright, so we're going in there. Why do I get the feeling we haven't seen the worst of this place? Because we probably haven't. Let's just keep it real. I don't, I don't think we've been in every part of these uh, ruined labs, but we probably haven't seen it all. Like, it's gonna be some big realiza realization or something. I no more. I, I can't take this. I'm washing my memory out with a bottle of Spectrum Red once we're back on the ship. Ooh. Let's, uh... <sighs> Wait, is that? No, that's not compacted human remains. <laughs> Take a look around a little bit more. Anything else through here? All right, so this is probably our way out. Okay, so what's over there then? Oh 
it'll bring us back through here. Okay. Into the elevator we go. Deeper into the abyss. Or higher into the abyss. Okay, so a firefight definitely happened here. Hello. I don't even know if I'm going the right way. Nope, because that's the exit. Okay. Something just rampaged through here. Test design. Outgoing messages. Lack of a hacking skill is really uh, messing me up here. Did you enjoy the show? I didn't. You should have let Gorgon hit its goal. Now I'm afraid I have to find a more permanent way to put you down. It's a good thing that. <clears throat> Well, you can keep up with the Sick. threats, but... I can't bear it any longer. Well, I'm glad. I've been looking forward to punching this crap fuck in the throat. Alright, well, it seems like we'll be meeting this person sooner or later. It's gonna be like, uh, Minnie's mother or some shit. I knew this place wasn't gonna be some pleasant seaside stroll, Captain, but I... I don't know how I can live with what we've seen here. Uh, what they did here is inexcusable. That tells Yon for you what he expect. Uh, they must have a reason for this. I'll just be glad to get out of here. All this cruelty done to regular working folks without even a shred of regret. And what's dogging me is, why? Prophet. They knew, Captain. Spacer's Choice knew all along what Adrena Time did, and they sold it anyway. I know, I can't believe they did this. Somehow it doesn't surprise me. Someone's gotta do something about this. Gotta hold folks to account. Maybe it should be us. Maybe Miss Ambrose can help fix things once she's cleared her family name. She could hold the board's feet to the fire. Make them pay. Let's get back to finding the journal. Uh, she'd better be paying a lot. Let's go. Only one way to find out where this leads. Yeah, let's go. Knowing the way late-stage capitalism like this works, no one's going to find out. Or if they do, out of here. no one, uh, no one's going to pay for it. This will probably lead us down to where we need to go to uh, s synthesis and manufacturing. Okay. Oh, that's Pravati. Are we like outside? Outside? We are. We need to go here. Hmm. Maybe... 
I don't know. We'll see. Let's just loot this place and get Looks the Looks like someone had a real fondness for sticky notes. What were they doing all the way back here? out of here? Nope. What's through here? Oh, oh, that's the door. That's the door we came out of. Okay. Front entrance. Ah, yeah, okay. So, from where we came in at, door from ruins. That's the closest place. I think we'll be able to take that bridge over. We'll see. Okay, so from here, from here, we go across the bridge and. God damn it. Oh my god. Gotta go all the way around, can't just jump down. Did we go in here? No, we didn't. this didn't we damn it okay down we go oh that's right we're gonna have to fight through a bunch of primals or we can just run from them we'll see I just need to find a workbench No primals spawn? Awesome. All right, got a clear road ahead then. Here 
here we are. Finally, the SMC. We'd better be getting paid over. I don't like that. I don't like the music that started playing the moment we unlocked this place. Oh boy, okay. Something's about to go down. Hello, Pam. Let's, let's save. Welcome to the Adrena Time Synthesis and Manufactory Center, brought to you by Spacer's Choice. This productivity auto mechanical unit is at your disposal. Its normal duties involve the management of legacy operations analytics. However, due to the promotion, demotion, death, or injury to other managers of this facility, this unit is now the acting manager of the following departments. Reception, human resources, Accounting, technical support, manufacturing, distribution, security. Please direct any questions about those departments to Pam. Answers not guaranteed. <laughs> okay. Uh, you're the only one here that makes this easy. According to this facility's hierarchy, there are zero acting managers at this Spacer's Choice facility. Not to worry. If a middle manager cannot immediately be replaced, Pam can safely oversee 3.176 departments. When you're in a productivity pinch, Pam can pick up the pieces. Uh-oh, it looks like there are intruders in this facility. Protocol recommends speaking to the head of facility security right away. So much for that. Uh, you're, but you're managing three points. <laughs> Management stretched thin? That's okay. With safety protocols disabled, Pam can manage 12.678 departments with an estimated worker fatality rate of only 4.83 per week. Damn. After all, Pam's purpose is to answer one question. How can I increase your productivity today? What's with all the bodies? So your productivity uh, auto mechanical. Tell me about the facility. The Adrena Time Synthesis and Manufactory Center is where Spacer's Choice's newest product is being created. Get a leg up on the competition with Adrena Time. You are now in the lobby. The floors above you are the offices, the manufactory, and the Adrena Time Synthesizer. The floors below you are the sublevels and the synthesizer reactor. How can I increase your productivity today? Did you know that keeping your workers alive boosts productivity? That's why every PAM unit comes equipped with the latest Spacer's Choice weaponry. When PAM's emergency combat protocols are activated, your investments are sure to be protected. Warning! Due to power consumption, combat protocols cannot be activated when PAM's power is below 73% without deactivating managerial processes. Spacer's Choice policy dictates that managerial processes take priority. This unit's power rating is 57%. Okay. C uh, can you override that? Pam is fully customizable to fit your preferred management style. With the correct override codes, you can alter any of Pam's behaviors at will. Some limitations apply. Spacer's Choice does not accept legal responsibility for any injuries or trauma sustained after altering Pam's behaviors. See manual for details. Uh, how can Hate I recharge messing you? with tangled cables or confusing batteries? With Pam, you'll never have to. Just pop in a Firefly brand industrial strength battery and Pam's ready to go. Out of hey, batteries and of need productivity now? No problem! Just hook Pam's power source up to another auto mechanical, and Pam will get your employees back in line in no time. 
Emergency combat protocols cannot be engaged at less than 73 per Please ensure that this unit is fully charged. Alright. Fuck you, I do what I want. I could give it a shot. Let me just... Huh. Okay. Weird way to do that, but there ain't no accounting for sense. There we go. All I had to do was convince this old girl here that 73% was the new 100%. Easy as salt tuna and sawdust pie. This unit's power rating is 100%. Great! Emergency combat protocols are now available. Error. Employee's biometric ID does not match this unit's designated manager. Proceeding with verbal management test. Oh dear Pretend God. that this PAM unit is one of your employees who has been working long hours. What would you say to give them an extra pep pill in their step? If you uh, could come in five, that, that'd be great. When you get in early and get out late, you're our favorite kind of teammate. Remember, Pam tracks every second you're at your desk. Employees in the 93rd percentile or higher get an encouraging platitude every day. Verbal management test complete. Result, employee is a spacer's choice manager. 94% certainty, engaging emergency combat protocols. Stand by. Okay. Oh, oh, she's just off to the races already. She's gonna take care of whoever these uh, intruders are. Okay, go on quiet. Can't buy taste. If I didn't know better, I'd swear it was watching me. So where did she end the lounge? She just went here? Oh my god, okay. She did come in here, right? Just carved a bloody path and left. I could have sworn I saw Pam run in here. Bracelet. Lovely. All right, let's get rid of that. Can't do anything with that. Bard. Okay, we're good. Sealed. Are all these sealed? No clue. Oh my god. Right, well, let's sell some junk here, grab some ammo. Is this the junk? Yes.
Hefty frame rate drop. They're on us. Oh, did Pam did Pam finally Or did she kill as many as she could see and then just left? Finally went down. It's okay. That 
we just came through there, I think. with those doors. Uh, watch your hands, Captain. Be a bad time to lose them. Well, I guess any time be a bad time, but especially now. Okay. Oh, shit. That scared me half to death. Oh my god. Big slow moving back. Well, Alright, we're all good. Everybody's okay. directly open that door but okay clear workbench thank god <coughs>
Okay. This thing kind of reminds me of the OSI building back in Edgewater. Like it's sort of holy. Phineas would love this. Wow. I, I smell boss fight, so hold on. Got to be Ambrose's office. We're close, Captain. Whoa. Utterly untouched. That's a lot of alcohol. Tell us what to do, are we, Captain? Starting to hope I get to meet this jerk, just so I can give him a good kick in the shins. <laughs> what well, he locked all the doors. I guess this is our only option. Through the vents, like a rat. Ladies, we're so close yet so far. I'm prepared for a firing squad to be on the other side of that door. Okay. Well, I never searched about them. So now all we got to do is go back to Mini. In we go. I don't know who this dude is. We're probably going to find out. But, uh... We are receiving an incoming signal, Captain. Let's hear it. Captain, I see you've made some headway on Gorgon. Mother's old work terminal just lit up with a bunch of new protocols. Very exciting. What about Mother's journal? Any progress there? Oh, I've got it. Uh, I think it's time you tell me the truth, Minnie. Are you accusing me of deception? Captain, I would never. Can you hear me, Captain? I'm getting some interference on my end. 
Captain. Captain! Um... Hello again, little weasel. I must Knew admit, it. you've surprised me. I threw nearly everything I had at you. And you overcame it all. Well spotted, Captain. We've both played our roles well, but it seems you've got the edge. I may have gravely underestimated you. You were smart to hire her, Wilhelmina. Well done. Mother! You're alive! And I'm still on Gorgon? You told me she was dead. I should log off and let you two get reacquainted. Uh, yeah, she's been a thorn in my side ever since I got here. Something tells me we've only seen the beginning. This is so you, Mother. Inserting yourself where you aren't needed and at the worst possible time. <sighs> Am I disrupting your vanity project, you empty-headed little twit? Am I missing something? <laughs> Mother is going to fill your head with lies about me and Gorgon. Don't listen. What? Have you come back just to ruin everything again, Mother? At least this time I have the power to stop you. Captain, this is a distraction. Let's set our differences aside and focus on what matters. Adrena time must never be revived. Ah, damn it. Okay, I don't have enough for that. Uh... I may not have told you all of the facts, but I'm going to lay out everything I know. You can decide for yourself what to do with it. By now, you realize that Project Gorgon was devoted to a single drug, Adrena Time. Mm -hmm. A drug that hit the market in spite of calamitous side effects. Quite right. There's no end to the harm a poorly run team can do, even with the best of intentions. The project was a colossal failure, but you and I are going to revive it from the ashes. After everything I've seen, absolutely not. Yes, let's make more drugs that turn people into deranged killers. Great plan. Uh, we... Let's see, I don't I know about this many... Adrena time was a lie. Our drug will fulfill its broken promise for workers and employers across the colony. Mother wasn't equal to the task. Thankfully for us both, I'm not my mother. What you've seen is the result of Mother's leadership. I have no intention of repeating her mistakes. Mother's journal contains the activation codes for the Adrena time synthesizer. The key to a new Project Gorgon. We're going to start again. And this time, with everything Project Gorgon didn't have. Better R&D, better scientists, clear goals, more funding, and a timeline that makes sense. Frown thoroughly. <laughs> and who's going to provide it? Uh, do you think that's all, uh, that's all it will take? Who else? Spacer's choice. After I showed them the error of their ways, the corporation couldn't wait to restart the project. If I can improve the chemistry, I can fix Adrena time. We can put this colony back on track together. That's completely insane. You lied to me. You're an idiotic sociopath. Why would I help you now? Finally, a sensible question. I am the head of Project Gorgon. Were. It's Grand Mastermind. I created Adrena Time because I believed, arrogantly, foolishly, that I could uplift the common man through chemistry. I failed. Mm -hmm. Now my daughter wants to take up my mantle. Don't be absurd. Minnie is a bright enough girl, but she's weak, flighty, 
She'd abandon the project at the first minor setback. My work has already destroyed countless lives. We can't let her do so again out of pride and sentiment. What about my life, Mother? The Ambrose name has no dignity anymore. I can't even show my face around Byzantium without being the gossip of the town. You have to be fucking kidding me. <laughs> you can't put your reputation ahead of the colony safety. Uh, be better than this. My reputation is a weapon. One that I can wield against those who squandered their one chance to save the colony. Every day workers slump over from exhaustion. The gears of industry swallow them whole and no one is coming to help. Adrena time is the break we can't fit into the schedule. The office with a window we can't afford to build. It's the best this rotten colony can do for people. Yeah, that's not a... That's, that's not a replacement for actual body functions. It's a bandage, not a cure. Halcyon is wounded, and I will do everything in my power to stop the bleeding. Don't let those bloodless leeches at Spacer's Choice walk you down this perilous path, Wilhelmina. You haven't the fortitude to endure it. As usual, Mother projects her failures onto me. If she had let me get involved from the start, we might have avoided this calamity altogether. Do you understand the challenges you'll face? Are you just trying to prove yourself to your mother? Uh, what do you... Hmm. Uh, why didn't you give Minnie a chance? My intentions are greater than some family squabble. Besides, mother is the one who should be proving herself to me. Fuck your intentions. What have you done? I always suspected you were nothing more than an empty-headed social climber. This confirms it. Jesus Christ. You see what I mean? Mother is afraid of being outdone by her empty-headed daughter, and she'll do anything to stop me. If I can save the colony and redeem the Ambrose family name, I owe it to myself to try. Mother be damned. With Adrena time, we can increase worker productivity orders of magnitude above ordinary stems and risk none of the harmful side effects. Imagine if we flooded the market with drugs that actually helped people. We could influence the very business model of Spacer's Choice. Uh, you want efficient, happy workers? Helcyon's problem is cruelty, not productivity. We won't be exploiting workers any longer. We'll be celebrating them. Giving them everything they need to succeed. But that's... No. This is madness. The project. The complex. It has to be destroyed. Raised to the ground. It's the only way. That's the definition of exploitation. Drugging your workers just so they can work 24-7? The project uh, was chaos. It doesn't deserve a second chance. Enough talk. What happens now? We already had our chance. Mother chose to bury the project and drag our family down with it. I won't allow her to make that mistake twice. In rehabilitating Adrena time, she would poison Halcyon. No, we are well past the point of compromise. The facility must be destroyed. I need that facility online, but I can't do it while Mother's still a problem. By now, she'll have shut down the Gorgon reactor. Deal with her however it suits you, and get that facility back up and running. Don't do this, Wilhelmina. Minnie, don't make this choice. Adrena time is our future. It's bigger than money, bigger than family. It's the colony's best hope. Uh, this could get ugly. Are you willing to chance that? What would you have me do instead, Olivia? Return to my family's manor, Captain. Use the executive override code in my journal to activate the NDA protocol for my terminal. It will destroy the Gorgon drug synthesizer and put an end to Adrena time for good. 
Minnie would never allow that. My daughter's gotten her hooks into you. I understand. She's always had a knack for manipulating people. But I know you're more than her foolish little puppet. You've survived this long. You have to be more. She will try to force you to fight her. You don't have to. In fact, I would ask you not to. Whatever mistake she might make, she... She is still my daughter. Captain, in light of recent events, I'm putting the manor under lockdown. Until Mother is dealt with, anyone who lands here is presumed hostile. Finish the job. I know you won't disappoint me. I don't owe either of you anything. What I do next, I'm doing for my own reasons. Both are optional. Yeah, we can't we can't do that. We can't do that. It's just gonna have to be putting her down if we got to. I'll try not to kill many, but might not have a choice. Oh, that is some music. Let's go! Stay on your guard, Captain. I think she's expecting us. Oh, I know she is. I don't think we're getting a warm welcome this time. That's totally fine. Momentum up. Oh, that's new. Here's we go. Oh, 
this. Where do I go? Right, so maybe it's down. Yeah, it sounds like downstairs. Expecting a wine cellar. Oh, my God. Okay, we're good. Okay, so that was meant for nothing, since it was a firefight the moment we walked in. Unexpected you. Here goes 
pieces. warn you not to set foot in here until the job was done? You should have listened to my advice. There's nothing to discuss. I can fix Adrena time without you, and certainly without Mother. You wasted your time coming here, and worse, you wasted mine. But I won't let anything stand in the way of progress. You need to stand down. I intend to destroy the project. What if you and your mo mother join forces to cure the Marauders? He'll surprise me, Captain. Once we fix the chemistry of Adrena time, the Marauder problem will simply take care of itself. How? But a lot of folks are gonna suffer in the meantime, and you don't even know if it'll work. The days of the old Adrena time are numbered, and Marauders are bound for extinction. Insane people addicted to drugs are mother's problem. Am I to be held accountable for her mess? It ain't about who's accountable. Those people are hurting, and they're hurting others. You could help them. Besides, Mother is determined to ruin everything she touches. First Adrena time, then our family, and now my ambition. She never gave me a chance, forbade it. I see no reason why she deserves a second one. And what about you, ma'am? Don't you deserve a chance to fix your troubles with her? Don't you both deserve that? Mother never led me anywhere near R&D. I was always her incompetent little brat. Stand down? I think not, Captain. People want to buy clean drugs, and I want to sell them. Under my leadership, Adrena Time will live up to its promise. Unlike certain mothers. Yeah. Adrena Time has already claimed thousands of lives, but I intend to succeed where Mother failed. But what if you My don't? My drug will be the pride and joy of the Ambrose family. And if we pick up where Gorgon left off, then the human testing phase is well ahead of schedule. Farewell, Captain. If it wasn't already obvious, you're fired. Well, we tried. convince her to stand down after we actually finally get in front of her, but right now, nope.
Oh, there's two of them? God damn it. point in that window. She's dead. something back here to loot. Where the hell was the door? Oh, up there? Alright, well, I guess we're going back in through the, uh... Through the normal door. That butler droid, uh, drone is still there. I can't believe I missed it entirely. It'll be a short little jaunt through the facility. it captain you've put gorgon down once and for all i only wish that many had seen reason the good we could have done together join me for a toast in the drawing room i do believe you're due a reward stay armed and ready captain i still don't trust her hand to law captain i mean you no harm Um, 
I'll have a drink waiting. Finally over. This, this, this unit expresses this. All right, Olivia. Pay me. I believe a celebration is in order. The Gorgon Project is dead, and we are not. <laughs> I have the weirdest deja vu right now. Aggressive toast to screwing the board. To Gorgon. And the grave it now rests in. May the Colossus of Adrena time never again rise from that dark pit. It's funny. When Spacer's Choice released Adrena time to the public and began the Marauder Crisis, and I sabotaged all the Gorgon facilities, I thought that was the end for me. Then you came along and changed everything. I find myself at loose ends now, Captain. What happens next? Um, have you thought of where you go from here? Maybe I'll find a handsome little bolt hole out there in the Aether and endeavor to keep a low profile, as they say. Maybe I'll pick up a soothing, useless hobby, like watercolor painting. <laughs> Spacer's Choice will want to take their turn at revenge. And I'd rather not be within reach when they do. Uh, don't let those corporate bastards catch you. Giving up on chemistry. I'll take it a day at a time. Run when I have to. Hide when I can. There's no glory in it, but I'm eager to put those days behind me. Where will the future lead you, Captain? I still got somebody to rescue from prison. I'm gonna start by getting a, a reward from you. I've got a mad scientist to rescue. I'd expect nothing less from the hero of Gorgon. In any case, I do believe this is the end. Law willing, Adrena time is dead for good. And the Marauders will die out with it. Goodbye, Captain. And thank you again. May the stellar wind be ever at your back. Okay, well. That's the end of it. So I thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, for joining me. When we return, we're going to try to rescue Phineas Wells and end the game. So I thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all tomorrow. Thank mm -hmm. you.